Yo, what is going on guys? Lottery Stocks here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel if you're new. So today I wanted to touch on this inverse ETF, inverse meme stock ETFs, what it's going to do, how it will affect us. So today this is the only thing we're going over. I'm not going to have much time throughout the second half of the day to make an update video, but I just wanted to give a quick update real quick and touch on the S&P 500, and that is that yesterday we expected a touch on 401 or 404 before seeing 390, and we actually did touch 401 and got rejected, so I am just expecting uh, 390 come to the near future, near short term, okay? So now let's get into this. Want to bet against meme stocks? REX shares plans new set of inverse single stock ETFs. Rex shares has filed with regulators to launch a new group of single stock exchange traded funds which will allow investors to bet against certain popular meme stocks like GameStop, GME, and AMC Entertainment. Along with GME and AMC, the lineup of single stock ETFs is slated to include funds tied to MicroStrategy Incorporated, MSTR, Coinbase Global, Peloton, Tilray, Nicola, Robinhood, uh, Beyond Me, and Penn Entertainment. The 10 specific funds are as follows, REX Short MSTR ETF, REX Short Coin, Short GME, Short AMC, Short Piton, yada, yada, yada. So this stock ETF is essentially shorting all of these companies at once if you were to invest in this ETF. Now, real quick, I just wanted to touch on this because a lot of people are freaking out about it. Here's what I see, right? It's all about liquidity. That's the only thing. That's the only issue here right because they can continuously short amc they can continuously short gamestop bed bath and beyond beyond me etc etc until they run out of liquidity so this essentially is doing absolutely nothing because even if they were to go short in an etf instead of the singular stock itself um, they would have to just essentially shift their short positions by covering and shorting over there if they would rather short a group, uh, a basket of stock. So I don't really see this as a problem. I think liquidity is still, you know, the thing, especially if you're in AMC and GameStop, I don't see this as a problem. And the reason for that is because AMC and GameStop are already going through a lot of DRS issues right now and just share counts in general with, uh, synthetics, AKA, uh, uh, Phantom shares, naked shorting, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So I think if anything were to continue, it would just continue on the singular stocks, and this, in my opinion, wouldn't really affect anything. If anything, right? Them, uh, you know, if anything, you think AMC or GameStop is more shorted or more, uh, you know, crime in the background compared to these other companies. This is essentially better in that case because they would be shorting a basket of stocks, therefore putting less selling pressure on each and every individual ticker, uh, aka AMC and GameStop. So essentially, guys, I wouldn't worry about this too much. Uh, this says, according to the U.S. Securities Exchange Commission filing, the ETFs are intended to provide investors inverse exposure to the daily price moves of the specific underlying single stock. Each fund invests in financial instruments such as swap agreements that provide inverse exposure to the underlying stock. At this time, there are no expense ratios or tickers attached to the 10 exchange traded funds. They then leave this at the bottom as a reason for this. So MSTR down 57.1%, COIN down 73%. GME down 21%, AMC down 65%, Piton 71%, Tilray 49%, Nicola 46, Hood 48, Beyond 62, and Pen 36. All of these are negative year to date. And the fact that they put this out to rub it in their face that kind of all these meme stocks are negative, they also left out that the entire stock market is in a bearish sentiment. So of course, meme stocks themselves that aren't blue chips are going to have an effect along with the market so this is kind of just obvious right here but that is what i got for you guys today i wouldn't worry about this at all i love you all lottery stocks out